Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. My name is Hunter if you guys are new here. If you're already subscribed, welcome back to my channel. Before we jump into today's video, make sure to hit that red subscribe button down below so you don't miss anything. I am at the Tampa airport right now. It's about 6 a.m. so super early. I have not slept in days. I've had to get up super early every single day for work. I just got off a three-day trip and now today I am flying to Pittsburgh to surprise John. He does not know I'm gonna be there, but the only issue is John doesn't land in Pittsburgh until 8 p.m. tonight, and my flight is at 7 a.m. I'm like, okay. So, that's a little, like, hard. But the good thing is I have so much family in Pittsburgh, so it doesn't matter. I have, like, stuff to do all day, and I have errands to run. I have to go to the DMV and get a paper for my car, which I know is just going to be a process, and it's going to take up a majority of my day. So, there's some time filler there. I just got my seat. I'm flying on Southwest this morning, since there's only one direct flight to Pittsburgh now out of Tampa. I'm like, what the heck, guys? So, hopefully it's just like a seasonal thing and they come back. But yeah, like I said, just got my seat. Southwest has open boarding, if you guys don't know. It means there's no assigned seats. You basically just take whatever seat is available when you get on the plane. Boarding is in about maybe 45 minutes. Before we get into the rest of the video, I do want to show you guys the new luggage that I'm traveling with today. It is by Go Penguin. You guys know if you watch all my videos, I usually travel with my crew suitcase. But I decided I don't really want to take my suitcase anymore because I have to use that for work. And if you guys watch my Paris vlog, it got destroyed coming back. And I had to buy a whole new work suitcase and those are not cheap that's the reason why I don't like to travel with that so I'm traveling with a new suitcase today so I'm gonna insert a little clip of that for you guys so you guys this is my new luggage from go penguin this video is not sponsored it is just in collaboration with them they did send me the suitcase so thank you so much to go penguin for sending me this it is awesome it has the 360 degree spinner wheels and it's made out of this super lightweight but super durable polycarbonate material which I really like and I got it in the color green I don't have any green luggage so this was definitely out of my comfort zone but I actually really like it and it complements my outfit choices really well on this trip and besides the quality and durability of this bag I love that it comes with a TSA approved lock so no one can go in your suitcase I haven't made up the code yet because I can't make up my mind but as you guys can see the zippers actually snap into place here so no one can open it without putting in the combination and then opening the lock so you guys can see I'm like struggling to open it right now but once you put in that code you can just pop that over and look how cool that was and it's honestly the perfect size it fit everything I needed for this three-day trip let me show you guys the inside and it has all the compartments I need my passport is in there all my clothes are behind there you can't even tell which I really like because if someone opens your bag like TSA or something you don't want them seeing all your stuff or whatever and then just in here I have shoes and then I have my chargers and stuff so it really is like the perfect size for a quick like three to five day trip and also this luggage does comply with all the TSA regulations and sizes and it fits perfectly in the carry-on bin like you guys will see in just a few minutes when we get on the plane. Other luggage brands run upwards of three to $400 for the same quality suitcase, which is crazy because you can get it for half the price at Go Penguin. If you guys wanna check out Go Penguin for yourself, they have so many different colors and options on their website. Guys, let me know in the comments which one is your favorite color. So there is gonna be a link down in my description box with a code to get 15% off your first purchase of Go Penguin luggage. If you guys decide to get that luggage, let me know down in the comments so I can message you guys and we can compare our suitcases together. So uh, thank you so much to Go Penguin for sending me this luggage. Right now, I need to go over to the gate area and get on my flight to Pittsburgh. I'm super excited. So I will talk to you guys when we get to Pittsburgh. Hey guys, I finally made it to Pittsburgh. It was a quick flight. I slept the majority of the flight and then I ended up for the last half of the flight watching Crazy Rich Asians. That is one of my favorite movies, if you guys don't know. I don't know why, but it makes me cry every time. Like when Nick proposes to Rachel on the plane, it just tugs on my heartstrings a little bit, guys. I know, it is very early still. Um, I'm waiting for my mom to get off of work. She is coming to pick me up and then we're going to dinner and the DMV and everything but I have to wait until she gets off work because I don't have a key to her new house. I don't really have anywhere to go. Like my whole family is working right now. Whole family and friends. It's casually like a Wednesday afternoon. What to do? I'm probably gonna go get some lunch or something, walk around the airport while I wait for her. Probably gonna go run into some of my friends that work here at the airport. It's kind of crazy. I know you guys probably think like John and I spend so much time together, but like, I don't know, like we haven't got sick of each other yet, so I'm just enjoying the time together. And that's all that matters, we're happy. All right, so I'm gonna go grab some lunch, 
and see what kind of trouble I can get into in the airport while I wait. So I will chat with you guys in a little bit. We just got over to the mall. I'm with my mom. She doesn't want to be on camera. Lame, I know. But you know, not everyone likes to be on camera, so I'm not going to put her on there if she's not comfortable with it. She is picking up a pair of tennis shoes. I don't really think we're going to go anywhere else in here. I don't really know, though. We might, because where I live, there's not really like a big shopping mall anymore, and it kind of sucks because I'm used to living five minutes from the mall. So maybe I can convince her to take me shopping today. But after this, we have to head over to the DMV, fill up that paperwork for my car, and then go to dinner with the rest of my family. And then John should be here around 7.30, and I'm gonna go to the hotel and surprise him. I hope he's excited. He's probably gonna be like, what are you doing here? He's probably looking crazy. So I will talk to you guys in just a minute. Oh my God, there's no one. All right, I gotta go. I think she's ready to go. I always wanna buy sweatshirts, but living in Florida, it's just like not practical to have this many sweatshirts. All right guys, I just got to the hotel. I'm like two doors down from John's room. I told John that I was gonna Postmate him food tonight from Longhorn, and I was like, oh, what do you want? And I'm like, oh, what's the room number so the Postmate can bring it up? And he's like, no, just have a meeting us. I'm like, no, 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 just send it up to the room. So I got his room number and I got the Longhorn bag. So we're gonna go surprise him. My first ever vlog was this same vlog, and that reaction was so good. So hopefully we can recapture that today. I hope he's surprised. He has my location, but I don't think he checks it, so. Let's head over to his room. I'm getting nervous. I have like butterflies in my stomach. All right, so let's go. I'm so scared. Postmates delivery. What are you doing here? What? <laughs> what are you doing here? I came to visit you. I've been here all day. Well, did I do a good job on dinner? You really? forgot my sauce. What sauce? My A1 sauce. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. But, thank you, I was hungry. Oh, you're welcome. Good morning, it is 5.30 a.m. and that's why I look like I'm sick, yay! So yeah, I don't look the best. I haven't got up when I sleep in like two weeks. I'm so, so, so tired. Now, you may be asking yourself, Hunter, why are you wearing this shirt again? Didn't you just wear that yesterday? And the answer would be correct. So, let me explain. I am non rimming today, and you have to have like somewhat of a casual dress code. Like, a little bit nicer, like a little more than like a t shirt and like shorts sometimes. It just depends like what airline you're flying. So, have a nice like polo shirt on. It's super cute. I'm feeling good about myself. Go brush my teeth. Nice, that nice polo shirt is now covered in white toothpaste. So I'm like, all right, well, luckily I had another like t-shirt that I could wear and then I just threw this shirt that I wore yesterday over top of it. And that's what we're gonna do, which is gonna be one of those days, I guess. The flight has two open seats, I'm number three on standby, so it can be iffy. I'm hoping I get on because it's the only direct today, so. Please stand by God's work some magic for me. Okay, so I just got to the airport. I dropped John off at his gate. He is on his way to Orlando right now. I am waiting to see if I can get on this flight to Tampa. When I checked in, she said there was one seat available and a number three on standby, so it's iffy. Hopefully I get on. If not, I'm kind of screwed. I'm gonna have to find another way home and there's no more direct flights today, so. Guys, say a little prayer for me while you're watching this video. If you're watching this right now, give it a thumbs up in hopes that I get on. I'm gonna head back over to the gate area and see what's going on and see if I get on this flight. This lighting though is very, very good. Um, I got my seat. I uh, Hopefully I can still get on. She said there's someone with like a leg brace. I hope you guys can hear me. I'm trying to whisper because there's like literally a million people right in front of me. Um, she said there's a guy with like a leg brace, so like I'm not sure if he's gonna have to like put his leg up on this seat, she said. If he doesn't, then I can get on. If not, then there's no seats left and I'm screwed. I have a, a lot of plans today, so I'm hoping that I can get on so I don't have to reschedule all of that. But I mean, if this guy has leg brace, I mean, there's not much I can do about it. I mean, I'm not gonna make him uncomfortable for like two hours, so we'll see what happens. Um, I don't know, I don't know what's gonna happen. Secured the seat. About to leave. Already packing, come with me. I'm not really asking. We'll get away to a place where we don't know. About to see. 
Hey guys, so I forgot to film an outro to this video, but I wanted to say thank you guys so much for watching this. I'm back at work now vlogging for you guys, so make sure to look out for those vlogs upcoming in the future. I know this video wasn't the most exciting video I've ever posted or the most interesting, but I wanted to put a video out for you guys. I like to post every single week for you guys, so let me know if you guys like to give this video a big thumbs up. And don't forget to go check out Go Penguin Luggage. Like I said, there is a link in my description box for 15% off your first purchase. Comment down below if you guys purchased any luggage from them, what color you got, if you guys like it, or if you guys already own the luggage, let me know in the comments. Subscribe if you haven't, leave me a comment down below. I respond to all of your comments, good or bad. Share this video with a friend, and I will see you guys next time.